fly tying video. Today we're tying a double leg nymph. The hook I'm using is a nymph hook, uh, three times longer than the normal one, and it's size 12. I've already put a golden bead on, and now to secure the bead, or so that it doesn't move when we'll tie the fly. I usually put three or four turns of small wire and this will keep the bead in place during the time so the thread I'm using is the uni thread in 8 oat and tan and we'll start by dressing the hook till about here I would say for the tag I'll use one strand of pink flashaboo or the best would be to have green but I don't have it so what I do is that I color it with a marker pen. This one is olive. And then you color the flash. Cut it down to easier to handle. And now you just make tight turns to form the tag. It should be around uh, two, three millimeters. And there we have our tag. I'll tie it in and cut off the excess. Now, I'll tie in the first pair of legs. I use English partridge in brown. You just or two. It's easier to handle with the hackle pliers to just take the tip and then stroke back the fibers. And now we'll tighten by the tip at the point of the hook. And then just tie down this and get off the excess. Stroke back the fibers and we'll make about two turns is enough. You don't want to overdress the hackle with too many turns. Then it would not look natural. So
that was the first pair of legs here at the back of the fly I think I have a little too much so I just trim it off so now for the body I'll use some squirrel gland it has a nice color and some longer fibers plant into it so it makes a nice body and you don't have to put on too much it's a quite slender fly so the body should be quite straight and not in a cone shape like that and now just behind the bead we'll put in the second pair of legs just as we did before it's easier with the hacker pliers so trim off the excess the fibers and make as before one turn and a half or two turns that's plenty and tie down cut off the excess And there we have our second pair of legs. Some squirrel blend to finish off here at the bead. I put on some glue to the thread and just whip finish. Three turns is enough. So cut off the excess. There's a double-legged nymph.